Alright, hello everybody. Welcome. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Uh, if you watch all of my streams, I didn't do anything last night because I was feeling kind of like garbage. Feeling a little better today, but we're going to change things up a bit here. And we're going to play on the Aspen Hills map on these nights. Uh, Real Farm the other day was I was supposed to do Respectable Island last night, but I was tired, so I didn't record anything. And Real Farm from the other day was giving me complications the other day, so we're gonna drop that out of the rotation. Even though it seemed like that was one of the ones that, at least as far as on PlayStation Network, not on YouTube, but that's where I was getting the most views. It seemed like, but if the game's not gonna cooperate with me, then I'm not gonna play it. So we're gonna change things up a bit here and. We'll be doing Snow Runner a few nights and Farming Simulator 19 a few nights. So Sunday night now is going to be my live night like normal, playing whatever, whenever. Monday, I'm going to be playing my flat map, making a map on that one on Farming Simulator. Uh, hopefully people will like that one because that one you can, I don't know. I guess it would make you more proud to make money because it's your own map. Uh, on the Tuesday nights, and usually I play really late at night, so the uploads aren't until the wee hours of the morning, like two hours of the morning, so it's more like the next day when the videos are available, but Tuesday nights are spectacle. Wednesday night is when I'm going to go to the Highway Hall and map. Uh, Thursday I'm going to be doing my seasons on Riverbird. Friday's today. I'm just doing this now, recording a couple, one episode real quick, and then going to take a nap before work. Uh, this is going to be the Aspen Hills map. Saturday, I'll be playing the Medvedine map on FS19. Uh, so, I will. Speaking of Farming Simulator, I'm, st I'm even still on the fence myself as to whether I'm going to pick up the new one right away because there's still an absolute ton of content on FS19, and typically those are games that go on sale a lot and often so it may as well kind of possibly wait till it goes on sale and then it looks like they're gonna be doing kind of the same thing like snow runner here they're gonna be doing a season pass like per year that type of thing and that's another one they they tend to always release all kinds of different versions of the games but anyway enough chit chat we're gonna play this map uh I kind of have no idea what's going on myself because I haven't played in a long time. I started up a long time ago and then kind of stopped and went out to one other map. Not that it's not a good map because hopefully he, he even sees some of these streams, but Remo makes some pretty good maps, so I think that's going to be going future here at least. At least one of the nights and a couple of the nights probably. I'm going to be playing on his maps and playthroughs, so let's see. Now let's see what's going on. I imagine I've already unlocked the uh, all the watch points, but I have no idea. So yeah, it looks like it looks like all the watch points are unlocked. So that's good. So now even now I'm not even sure why I'm uh, why I'm in this guy or with that that machine that I don't want to use. <laughs> It might have been a mission I did just before this. Speaking of which, let's just back up to this one, see what this is. Make sure I already, yeah, I already activated it. Alright, good. So, let's see what tasks and whatnot there are to do. Don't I have, uh, there's no contracts? What? Must be just tasks. Okay then. I think this actually might have been a map that he released initially with no no tasks or contracts or anything like that. So yeah, two concrete slabs. That's the one we're probably gonna want to do first. Deliver slabs to there. And where do we where do we get them? Right here. So, 
that's the old days after to the get the old days after task. First we'll check to see if anyone's uh close by. And then otherwise we'll probably go to the shop and pick out a vehicle to get going. It's got a big old trailer, a couple of big trailers. Yep, so it looks like we're gonna have to go to the garage and get a some kind of scout or something. Who's this? Who is it? I don't think the cons can't usually do me any good, so. First, let's go to the garage. Then, okay, it looks like we have unlimited money, so good. And we have a butt ton of trucks in our... ton of trucks in our... this one yet so can you put like a uh, check him out suit first to see if you can put some kind of flatbed on it nope doesn't look like it because it doesn't look like you can customize it at all so not using that one at least not for now this one I know you can And actually, yeah, now that I think about it, that won't work anyway. Because concrete slabs are two slots. So, let's just get one of these guys out of here and. Probably shouldn't have done that because I don't think he can get like a cargo bed either. Yeah, no. Oh, wait. Sideboard bed, sweet. Sweet. So we'll use that. And that will kind of mod them up a little bit because I don't know what we're dealing with here. Because I haven't played in a long time, so. This is, yeah, now I remember, this is the one you kind of got to watch it, because <laughs> you can, uh, you basically you got to turn around to get out of here. And some of the... Depending on what transmission and what truck you are, some of them are, little, are a little jumpy, and it'd be real easy to just launch it right off the hill there. Get him turned around, shut down, and then see what happens. Now, if I remember right, some of these areas, like down there, are real muddy and really deep water. Like, really deep water. Your truck disappears. Darn it. 
So now, uh, no, that's where we need to. We need to go all the way over there. Okay, easy enough. Well, easy enough as in a direct enough path. Maybe not so much easy enough. Because usually these lighter colored roads are usually the ones that are muddier. I don't remember this section. This section being terrible though. It's down in like this section. Down here it's super muddy. If I can remember correctly. Should have been that way. So we'll try and get this task done and upload it and take it and happen and see what happens. So yeah, Remo, if you haven't watched any of these, thank you for your maps because they're pretty great. Could pick some stuff up there. Yeah, there's a nice rock crawling section. And it looks like we're going to have to go back the same way we came because we're not going to go rock crawling with this thing. to yeah have to go there and then come to here go this way so this may or may not be tricky because I remember this section too like it's not too super muddy but going up this hill I think it was it's it's pretty like uh rocky not rocky as in rocks in it but undulations in the terrain so it, like it tries to uh tries to flip you over a lot <coughs> so let's see what we can do And if the people who design this game are devs or whoever. Cruise control. Put cruise control in there, damn it. Possibly even a mini map. Let's not be silly. All that stuff over in the left corner can easily be put somewhere else or not even beyond the hut at all and put a mini map there. So this is the Aspen Hills map. It appears there's only tasks on here, so this may or may not be a quick playthrough. And on to on to another one of his maps. I already have uh, a High Rock High Rock County. I think that's another one I already have downloaded that I played for a minute and stopped. I don't know, I know I have one more downloaded already. That'll be next after this or Highway Holland. Highway Holland, we still have a bit to do. Pretty much all the contracts and all the rescue missions of the tasks, which I'm stalling on. Smart thing to do would be to pick up the trailer so I can get this all at once, but I'm not smart. And I prefer to I prefer to not use trailers. I would rather make multiple trips with multiple trucks. Just because it's, it's fun. And see how the different differently or whatnot.
suddenly I'm starving too. Or not too bad. It's got more of a Michigan feel to it, that's cool. At least the colors. What I don't get, well I guess maybe they did go back and do some of it, but I can't remember with one of these updates because I haven't played the normal game in a long time, but and not that I particularly like driving in them, but I don't know why Michigan doesn't have any, like, snow regions or snow on it. It's just as much snow in Michigan as you do in Canada. At least some areas. There probably should be some, probably should be some s snow maps in Michigan. So thank you for watching, listening to me talk, please like and subscribe, comment what you do or don't like. It's one of those things where I'm going to play anyway, so might as well record and hope other people enjoy it, but change things up a couple times, either because not getting any views or real early game crashing, stuff like that. Far from famous. Don't need to be, but it would be extravagant to have quite a few people enjoy the stuff and get a little bit of supplementary income. Far from famous and far from greedy. Let's turn around, actually. Turn around and double check what these are. Make sure they're activated. That's gonna be a pickup one. Yeah, we're only gonna be able to get one in here. Off we go. I think I'm already going the wrong way. Yep. That's the rock calling route. We do not want to go that way. fly over there with this one, get one delivered, then probably pick another truck and do it all over again. Get this bridge fixed.
I remember correctly, but this route kind of shifting your weight back and forth trying to throw you over. have some trouble with this tree. Oh, that's the one that you get stuck on. You bastard. tree. He likes to grab you. It just beeps, but my headphones on, so I can't tell. Diff lock off, so I can turn. Yep. See, it's kind of. Well, I took it to extremely wrong path, but kind of rocks you back and forth. Oh, sweet. And another tree that's going to try and eat me. Such a risk there.
out of the way. Now, that's the one that's sunk here. Yeah. I'm not sure if... I think it, maybe I did do that myself, trying to find a way around or something. Uh, it's right there. Like he's got like a uh, little check change from the seat, but it looks like he's got a saddle on him. Yep. He ain't gonna do me no good. Back to the garage. Back to the drawing board. And should we take one from our storage, or should we buy it on the truck? trucks available then you go to look at it like oh it's not available in this region let's try that truck because I don't think I've driven this one too much at all if at all choice anyway. I guess I guess that's my option. 